Good evening to you and thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. My name is Cheryl Blessing and you are watching The Power Talk Show. Now before we went on a break, we were trying to figure out what progress have we made this year, especially with focus on our goals and our resolutions. This is the last month of 2023. I want us to assess between January and December, 11 months have passed, what have we done this year and how have we grown individually and in our careers and every other aspect of our life. So go on our social media platforms, which is at Y254. Niandike comment. Kamu kona opinion, kamu kona swali, niulize and I will sample that as we get to the end of this show. Now, before we went on our break, we were talking to our artist, Kruger Gash. Kruger Gush. Kruger Go... At this point, Dazak to me to Jina for formal. I tell you, Julie. You tell me what Jina formal, so I still do. To say me Jina, I do. You're concerned you could have traditional. Yeah. actually. For real? Yeah. Aya. So say you don't know Rudy. And I do Kakata. Sijakata. I can work with artists. Just giving the world what it needs. Nice, nice. Amen. We like that. No, no, no. Next to him, we've been joined by our other guest, who is Samonje Mugoya. He's the CEO of Samonje Vazi. Is that right? Yes. Sir. And you're a model, a fashion and a commercial model, Pia. Yes. Karibu sana. Asante sana. This is the second time having you yes, here. Yes, yes, yes. Karibu. No, Una feel I feel poor. I'm going to go home. Cindy, yeah. oh? I'm going to go home. Of too. course. I'm going to go home. I'm going to go home. Uko ni familia, sindi ya unengi ya jikoni. Karibu nengi ya kitchen, ni ose miongo za habari. Oh my God. Tuko poa, we thank God. So we're just talking about progress in your tumeme kimuaka. And I know, ata we mwenyewe umekuata, you've been nominated to some awards which are happening this weekend. Kwanza ninth, sir. Tuo kwanza. Ninth. So kila mtu wa kwe tuned in. Mwende kwa social media pages. Mwangalie. So, yeah. Tuambie venye mwaka ilianza. January versus right now. Okay. You ni one of the progresses that you've made, but okay. overall, una feel ni kama mm -hmm. life yu mikuwa different aji. Like how have you grown? Have you achieved your goals, your okay. resolutions? Una feel ni kama kuna difference? First of all, imu waka kianzia. Uh, I've been in the fashion industry for seven years. Eh? So, wakati ilianza imu waka, nilikuwa nataka ku give up na history of fashion. What? Siju kwa nini, nilikuwa nimechoka, nilikuwa mifika kukuta sana. So, but inende kishi kikuwa better na kikuwa poa, nikianza ku get more meaning and and uh, kupenda more the craft ya mm -hmm. fashion lakini sana nika nikakachi nikajiuliza saa utaacha fashion utafanya nini nikakuna dilemma nice. kidogo <laughs> nika <laughs> <laughs> najaribu ku twist hivi najiambia ah if fabric nafanya mambo nayo alafu na kama ukitupoa niko ile ah by the way unataka kuenda unaenda wapi unaenda na hii ndio passion yako manze 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 so mm, eh, ikienda kishaisha Kwanza tukianza January, si kujua ata January kingia. Juni kwele, ah, let me relax and write down my resolutions. Ndoi December, ndoi isha fika. Mwaka isha isha. Manze, manze, manze. So, kwa hii mwaka, achievements ze nime, mi nime get, na already nime kuja ku understand, na nime kuja ku value more kitu nime kuwa nikidu. Nime kuwa nime ipe more value na nika kuja kuya appreciate more in a different angle kwa sababu nilikuwa hile ya Majuwa sa zingine, sa zingine unazoya karia mbake inakuwa ah Chantoke hapa kuna boy side, sijuni enda side ingine laki kuwanza tena si mchezo So sometimes as it breaks zuko waga crucial Juu at least unafau figure out tena mbona ulipenda yu kitu Ata nikuwa juuliza mbona nilianza And I like mwenye pia umesema, ati mwaka imeisha. Nikene kwa nika resolution doi December hape isha fika. Nado tuliko nasema, right before we went on a break, tuliko tunasema, it's never too late. Bado hii ni a few weeks, you can still do something. No achieve, achieve. Eh, na usema nyo 2023. It may have been December, but I did something. Sindio? True, true. Na hiyo ndo progress na feel lenye napenda. Especially when you nasema, unadzo kuna challenges. When you're doing a craft for so long, sengini na get monotonous. Unashindwa, eh, minu mikuwa sasa on air like mko maktaimi eh ni nini eh ni ufi luki grow eh si ndio kwa kwa zingine that maktaimi ni maktaimi eh kwa hile eh na kill to inspiration inspiration baka na unajopia another thing we were talking to Bimix who's one of the friends wa Kruger okay na 
alikuwa ananiambia pia yeye na feel ni kama ako na doubt how nini kama mimi make progress But. so nime come to realize sengine we do not see our progress true, true, true. ni mtu mwingine ndo anaweza sema eh by the way yeah, ume change yeah, yeah, yeah. si ndio and that's another thing tulikuwa nasema importance ya kuandika goals zako alafu pia maybe hata reflection mm -hmm. useme january nilikuwa na mindset na kaa hivi Sign. april ikafika nika change sign december ama whole different person true, true, true. yeah so sasa hiyo ni part of the challenges zenye umekuwa nazo si ndio yes, yes, sure. ume have ku fall in love again with your craft mo hata zaidi hata niko ile sasa stoki oh say uko mo pacha say me confirm eh ni confirm hii sasa acha tu ni do sasa hadi kwenye italian tu sasa kama ni kuanguka acha tuanguke na tuangukie hapo manzi na laugh tena niko na so much hopes kwa hii award ninachukua saa tu siko ninasikia ka spirit kakiniambia una win Amen. Una <laughs> win. <laughs> Sindio. <laughs> Cuz that's another good thing. And you know your recognition pia inakupatia hiyo moral. So Kruger, tuambie we challenges zako hiyo mwaka imekuwa gani? Cuz mtuambie Yesu me grow, me learn lessons, but ni times gani uliko na feel we uko sure na hiyo mwaka? Ama hiyo mwaka uko tu me bad. January ilikuwa. Ame January ile una not was a man in January. <laughs> ilikuwa refu. Mimi nilikamii babana. So January ilikuwa nilikuwa beat broke. Sijui like hadi nifanyaje about the craft na feel tu na mark time hivyo. So that's one of the challenge. Yo brokenness na pia sa zingine inspiration inapotea like najipata yeah. niko nilisikia kitu deadlock kama nini <laughs> can't remember the name like naweza ka anawa mm -hmm. na sitapata even a single line mm -hmm. so ina ku discourage sometimes eh, kule yeah, uko sure na fact change lens eh ama ni nini nashindwa niko kwa lens tofauti but So and I think ata cuz mm -hmm. sorry but mm -hmm. in the creative arts especially kwanza mm -hmm. kama wewe ni entrepreneur mm -hmm. wende unajihasulia unajipush okay. it's harder to get your motivation and inspiration sometimes si ndio cuz you've said you're a writer mm -hmm. and then you also perform and mm -hmm. you you do all that mm -hmm. so saying ngine unaweza kuwa maybe una feel any shadrain content yangu mm -hmm. na most of the time una draw inspiration from your real life and mm -hmm. experiences zako True. so ni understandable when you lisema sengine ku take break kusema mm -hmm. let me step back mm -hmm. ni reflect and mm -hmm. then you come back to the drawing board and figure it out mm -hmm. namna feel ni kama economy unaona economy mwaka pia imekalia watu si ndio kwa sababu tuambie unaweza we you have to source fabrics you have to price all these things on my on my side imekuwa tricky saa zingine unapata like your fabric maybe kama ya suit ama ya shirt pengine nafaa ku buy maybe it's worth maybe kama 3000 for example so the economy mende ki change change na nikipea client maybe your shirt maybe shirt tell me a suit mm -hmm. let's let's use the example a suit a complete suit simple two suit maybe 7000 eh fabric nikiweka ndani ni nini nini so size unapata in exceed inakuja mpaka inakula mpaka yangu mpaka oh. niko ile na tena uweze rukia customer muambie add more money na maybe alikuwa yeah. client wako before na ready ama mlikuwa mshaji jafunga deal mjafunga deal ukienda soko unaambia ah ah tuna your price any more eh bei iko hivi na hivi na hivi so inakuwa bit challenging na bado saa zingine eh uchumi pia ime imechangia sana bado kutingiza career zetu pia saa zingine uko ile ah ndaweza ku afford career yangu eh juu saa zingine life inakuwa expensive and resources around na wewe zinakuwa maybe still expensive for you yeah. una feel at least shaken kidogo no no it's important kwa sababu i feel like so many companies okay. mimi mwenyewe nime witness True. wana amend prices zao okay. either they have to ongeza prices Mas, because yeah. of ku reciprocate your mm -hmm. vat and everything else yeah. enye wanapata ndio wapate at least profit True. usitoke tu hapo ukiwa ni eh ni kama mm no no zapia clients wa, wa pesa iko yeah, watu wamekatwa do so yeah, like uko sure ni tanunua suit ama ni tanunua unga kwa nyumba na contact sasa ngao anaenda ku complain ya mtu venye economy iko lakini it's too way ata venye anaumia mpaka anaumia upande wake so so mnashindwa tukae kwa meza to compromise about the price lakini kwa ile if we compromise about the price ule dealer hata compromise on my side so unapata kama kwa fabric maybe ameongeza bay so client maybe mki negotiate na yes una mind na pia una mind lakini unashindwa sasa 
what's the best way to go eh sasa zingine juu ya hiyo story economy sasa zingine inakuwa challenge but tibu acha strong level yes to adapt from that tibu utuambie from your experience because i'm sure you have to pay for studio sessions if you're shooting videos brand yako tu lazima ukwe na pesa kama artist sasa ndio mafuta ya gari i was just when artist sasa hiyo una una kitu kwa mfuko true true so how has the economy impacted wewe na craft yako and everything when you remember my january lens kiwa chini kiasi like when mwaka imeendelea imekuwa affecta je so um, craft like especially music videos sijako hebu ku get more of them they are a bit costly e, ukiangalia economy manze the little na get na fa ku balance between bills personal bills na, na ku invest kwa career yeah. mm. so sasa zingine unapata bills in out way career, career. Mm. eh kulingana na ile budget kidogo uko nayo mm. so unapata tu mak time tu na mak time tu wewe <laughs> 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 uko na sema data kusikiza nitafanya next na month mm. next month ikifika something ina happen tu yeah. unapata au jafanya una compromise tu na hiyo ndo i feel like watu wengi youth wengi wame complain about Sana. you cuz unajua bills mm-hmm. awezi kosa kulipa rent Plus. awezi kosa kuweka pesa ya fare mm-hmm. utaenda aje kwani utatembea mm-hmm. basi eh mm-hmm. so sasa na hizo challenges mm-hmm. mna, mna compromise like how are you kama tebu tuambie mm-hmm with the, you and your your company mm-hmm. how have you managed with the economy ume change prices like ume have to kuwa strict tunasema eh, sasa kuna kuna discount imebidi imekuwa hivyo sasa imebidi ni kuwa strict kidogo lakini bado still na mind juu mimi najua my clients wakipata do mimi ndio ndapata mm. so kama client wangu hajapata do so niko ile ah even me I'll struggle kwa yeah. sababu kama yeye complain what about me and mm. my boss True. so inakuwa a bit challenging lakini inabidi tu saa zingine tunakaa chini tuna reason eh mm. before tunaona nilikuwa nakufanya na pesa so saa hizi imeongezeka itabidi umetop up pesa fulani juu vitu zinapanda hata na 10 bob overnight tukitoka yeah. ishengia 20 bob 50 bob aki <laughs> kuna buy 30 bob ishengia 70 <laughs> hey, in, in two months kwa time eh kwa nini unanigonga eh, unanigonga mpaka <laughs> na kuanisha hapana na ukikuja kuba hivi unakuta hata kwenye traffic ni kubwa watu wana buy yani patie pieces tatu ni pay ine mpaka yeah. kwa ile ah It's me who I'm delaying. Una stop up yako. Eh. Na bidi nafika bei unatoka tu. Si ndio. And I feel like pay ni discouraging kiasi. Ukiona ni kama labda una struggle alafu una watu tu wako sawa. Wana bai wako sawa na stock inaenda mpaka kwa ah. Sawa tu. Unakubali. But ni progress. I feel like ni kila mtu ako na journey yake. So it's just your personal journey. True, true. Na sasa Kruger, tutafanya aje na music videos. Si tunaanza saa ku record na simu. Same of course. Si ndio. Alafu right now venye wamesema Nairobi, wame support creatives. Mm-hmm. So maybe those are alternatives. Ume explore hizo alternatives or what else have you done? Ndio at least supplement your your pesa kidogo unapata and effort yenu una make. So nimekuwa hapa yani ki try ku improvise hivyo venye unasema. Mm-hmm semo tumia semo pia kuongeza some bit, some skills pia at least naweza gedit ya some of my videos mm. and as na hepa your cost ama na for, for, for moment na hepa your cost yenye maybe ninge in car mm. eh juu nimeongeza hiyo skill juu ni poa sana yeah. i like when you tell me bring up hiyo because that we were talking about that ku maximize on your skills yeah. unajaribu kama venye we ni artist mm. unaweza kwa you you write you sing una unafanya editing unaweza shoot video unaweza yeah. kwa producer i feel like you pia ina idea because mm. economy ya squeeze lazima uko na skills yeah. more si ndio lazima lazima samonze wewe ndo una design na unafanya so, everything so mm. inabidi sasa vitu vingine normal outsourcing yeah. so you do it on yourself alafu maybe hata sasa hapa inabidi tunaingia kwa tutorials tunaona kama kuna skill flani ukua na <laughs> <laughs> Pale ni YouTube University. Na Wahindi pale. Na Wahindi wana kwanga na info. Very detailed. Ndio. And I like when you mna say maybe because una kuna so many ways of us learning. What one we like complaining. So we'd rather go on social media and rant about the economy, vitu ni ngumu. But what skills can you learn? 
because as you're having your phone come up on internet what can you do on your phone that's going to make that extra money or that's going to supplement you need a new feel sindio it's important for you to learn instead of kukatu na kukomplain because kukomplain is idea sindio it doesn't it doesn't one thing ukienda ku run to social media when you economy or no one is coming to aid Yeah, true. Ni wewe na mfuko yako. Ni wewe na mfuko yako kwa zote ta type comments but leave your two. They can use that against you still. True, very true. Eh, kuna zote sema wewe na suffer tu hapa. Na struggle like one instance. Maybe una complain about price flani at imepanda 10 bob na under unaweza ito Mr. 10 bob. So unajitunga sana eh. So ni poa pia una na get your wisdom ya kumanuva the matrix. Mm. 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 sana. Yeah. And I feel like kwanza squeeze the youth of today in Kenya, mm -hmm. you have to work smart. Mm. Unajua kitambo watu walikuwa naambiwa work hard, work squeeze. Ni akili. Unatumia akili. You have to work really smart so that you at least grow and get to the same level as your peers. True true. Mm. Na mna feel ni kama having multiple jobs because we've talked about having multiple skills. Mm -hmm. Mnaweza kuwa na multiple jobs ndio supplement ako ka pesa kidogo cuz unajua kitambo people could survive on one salary. Squeeze yako ka salary uko like crazy. Uko sure na kana struggle. Kata 70%. Eh and then you need more. Ama mwezi nafika katikati uko like we. Ni kubaya. So aside from designing and nini cuz unafanya pia modeling. Do you feel like unaweza tafuta manini zingine job zingine ndo zi supplement hizo zi unafanya? So as for me we mimi naweza advice eh vijana maybe uko nje pamoja mimi nikiwa included ni ju either way tutashukisha standards zetu na tutashukisha lifestyle yetu ju ni must to buy vizuri, ni must to live hizo bills na tuishi ka nyumba kazuri. So kitu inataka ju bado still tukiona hizo madoido zetu on the side ni ina 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 inabidi sasa mtu akoe at least na hizo side hustles mob sana yeah. ama bidii kwa zaidi sasa kama ulikuwa unafunga saa tatu sasa push kidogo sasa eh. two hours extra maybe ama kama unafunguaga saa nne maybe ali kidogo saa mbili so at least una go extra kidogo ndio ku maintain hizi mambo yako juu mm. Ni kuna vinyo So you have to supplement one by another. Unapata pressure So Kruger, let's read the comments. Alafu tuambie pia wewe as an artist how you're supplementing your nini pesa ya gigs and from your artistry. So let me go on uh, this is Facebook. Many to me comments then you thank you so much for reaching out. So Josiah Sagwe says I'm not yet near because the diva I intended to marry just got sick the other day. <laughs> and if she doesn't <laughs> recover quickly then it will be my 2024 new year resolution. God willing quick recovery babe. Quick That recovery, is so babe. sweet. <laughs> That is so sweet. Eh tunakuambia hata wewe I hope apate quick recovery alafu goals zenu ziendelee venye mlikuwa mpanga hata kani 2024 bado ita happen. And then J Rock says 75% achieved. That's so good. 75 is more than half which is very very good. MC Oguyo says we try again next time. Inaeleweka. Inaeleweka. Sindio, never give up. Next year bado ni mwaka. Favored Mary says starting a fresh come 20, 2024. That's also good. Kila mwaka, kila week I believe it's a new start. Mutuku Every new day yeah, it's yeah, a new start. Mutuku Kituka Wanzeni says Wagwan Wagwan Mutuku uko poa. Deno Jiwali says next year is that true. Next year is coming and we'll do better. Uh to Rive to Ronnie I think says soon it's in 2024. That's very true. In a few weeks tunaenda 2024. Waka Waka Ngondi says watching and he also says Kitui West following. Thank you so much for watching us. David Blessed says tuned in nikiwa Mombasa. Asante sana David kutu watch. Ndovu Niku says Kitale well represented. Thank you for that as well. So when you tunona unajua kuna watu wenyewe at least wame wame make moves, at least wame achieve some goals, some resolutions. Na kuna watu wengine hii mwaka imekuwa tu 
Wacha ishe. Eh wacha tu ishe. Si ndio? Like I blink mwaka ni kuisha. Eh mwaka ni kuisha. Time imesonga. And it's so understandable. I feel like either way, bora uko na mentality ya tunaanza again, bado nitafanya more and what not. That's a very good mindset to have. So Kruger tuambie, aside from you being an artist, tell us what are the jobs? What are you doing to supplement ako ka pesa nyuna pata so that you're able to to pursue your goals and your resolutions? Uh, your question reminds me of my sis. My sis keeps on telling me you should have a passive income. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, as, lo- uh, uh, as, as much as I sound bizuri kwa kichwa, mm-hmm. you have to do it. Mm-hmm. So I have a day job. Mm. I work as a sales person, Mali. Then Kitokea, besides writing, I do some photo editing. Na pia na na nafanya nini? <laughs> na saidia pia artist wenzangu. Mm. Eh, at least pia wanafika hapa. Of course, si mimi si kazi si kazi ya buri. Si ndio, eh, you have to be Tunatafuta si wote. Yeah. So, Eh, uko pia na get some passive income. I also sell merchandise za Kruger Bush. Mm. Mm. And that's really good cuz unaona when your sister ko nasema, unfortunately squeezy for real we need a passive income enye. Mm. Mm. Unaka ukijua pesa inaingia kwa account mm. pale flani. Si ndio enye una pressure <laughs> kusema wa sasa tutakulaje. Sasa hii tumefika era flani kama in the movies like you yeah. have to work a double shift. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Because the way it's going. Sasa <laughs> <laughs> yeah. na, na feeling nikitoka job na feeling ni kana ingia job ingine. <laughs> <laughs> Umeenda sasa night shift. <laughs> <laughs> na unajua pia napenda venye umesema unatumia skills zako ku monetize pia. Yeah. You you doing editing for people, you helping other artists. So those are other ways enye unaweza pata. Unajua unaweza pata punch, thao nini na ina adapt. Mm. Sana mm. sana. Yeah. So I want to venye conversation it kwa about to end let's talk about venye mwaka ina progress how have you adjust your your resolutions cuz unajua mwaka ikianza labda ulikuwa unasema nataka ni kwa global artist eh alafu ukaka uko na eh wacha nianze na East Africa Sindio because you have to assess the situation alafu ndio ujue tuna progress aje so someone say venye umesema hii mwaka ilianza ikiwa sijui aje kabisa nifunge hata hiyo show eh so tebu tuambie ukiendelea una feel kama ume adjust nini kwa maisha yako na mindset yako kitu ya kwanza nime adjust ni my mentality nimekuwa ile life lazmi move on eh yeah eh eight away life iko juu iko chini lazima tusonge yeah eh na unakumbuka hata acha tutumie hata basic example si unga unakumbuka ugali kuna wakati ilikuwa aga karibu inaingia 300 mm. yeah. still watu walikula si ndio eh so eight yeah. away sasa lazima tukue na hii positive mentality ya uh, life itakuwa poa na ni bid tuongeze kidogo na apart from hiyo bid ni expectation to see kuna big expectations for ourselves true eh alafu pia isichangie pia tu kuwe reluctant at juu life iko juu either way hakuna hakuna life ikipanda tuseme kama for example e watch ilikuwa inauzo 5000 ipande ikuwe na ikuwe 5500 haita waishuka irudi tena 4000 manze haita wai wale vitu azishuka ni kama matrix ni kama matrix unakumbuka hata matrix zilitokaga 10 bob kitambo na wazo zote kwa sema unajua nikiwa na 10 bob ningefika hapa ni 70 mia so ni lakini god ni faithful kwa sababu still anatupatia we imagine tume survive hii mwaka ni imeisha na inaisha by the way imekuwa tricky imekuwa tricky kwa hizo bills ku kumanu and unaona pia i like what you're saying hakuna venye life ita unajua hata ukikaa uko complain useme we leo sasa mafuta ndio yeye imepanda hakuna venye utaenda u change mafuta unless you have the power so ni wewe una adjust mm-hmm. mindset yako na life yako mm-hmm. ndio ufit hiyo hiyo mm-hmm. life yenye iko si ndio mm-hmm. kama ulikuwa na leisure flani for example eh, kama ulikuwa na burudani mob kila mtu akona perspective yake ya burudani pengine yeah. mimi napataga madoa naanza kubai maviatu mm-hmm. ama mwingine apata madoa na lewa sana ama mwingine apata madoa nafanya vitu zingine kani ma, kama ni madem najua nyinyi na maviatu na ma beauty products najua mm-hmm. unachukua kaa zote so unapunguza unaona hii ni necessary hii ni necessary <laughs> na hapo ni shida <laughs> ukiangalia kwa <laughs> discipline <laughs> ukisha lipia skin care ni wewe let's do eh uko like ukitebuka hii mwezi isha tu jina ku drainisha vinaoma sana yeah. Yeah. So una compromise on on your lifestyle alafu una concentrate na priorities kwanza. Mm. Kulipa hizo bills kama nyumba na 
taking care of yourself na at least watu wasa bado ku check on their mentality na yeah. stories and mindset za kwanza mm. mindset hapo ndio big star ndio like big star si ndio usisahau kujiangalia ki kimawazo ki unaishi surrounding yeah. eh, na pia tu pia mimi kitu nimejifundisha kwa hiyo muda eh, nataka ni avoid pia stack complain sana juki complain na kuja na kwa lifestyle sasa haki zimepanda haki zimepanda haki utashinda hivi mpaka watu watachoka na story yako eh. hata mimi watu wakianza kusema ti story life imepanda ni kweli imepanda na hata inatunyanyasa na hata tuna do na hata si ati hata mimi niko na opportunities fulani fulani ati at avenues zinalipa enough mm. juu still our clients wangu ndio wana complain yeah. lakini nataka kujitoa sana kwa hiyo group yao ya kuko hivi kuko hivi kuko hivi sasa hata wakiongea mimi najipe moyo kidogo mm. <laughs> najiambia kutakuwa so. poa kutakuwa mm. poa kutakuwa poa eh cuz mm. the fact that hata tuko sai tuko si ni december imefika yeah. like as much as everything has gone the way it has mm-hmm. in waka with the war na hizo mm-hmm. ma stress na nini mm-hmm. tuko hapa tuko alive na bado tunaka vizuri na tunaka poa sana ndio tumejiangalia sana sasa tuacho kwa sawa eh so tuambie pia wewe uli uli mention that mindset yako ime change in the aspect of your networking your relationship nini ingine pia ume change like mwaka iki progress una feel difference gani zime zime happen in your mindset na pia kwa actions zako kuna pesa na change mm. like change ni inevitable that's one thing me realize so is a price change tax nini hizo vitu zote eh ni coffee nazo najua lazima zi happen maybe the buy in a negative way ama positive way so when you adapt nazo pia ndio ina mata cuz fast says you control your change when you happen it's yeah. beyond me so when you pia na 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 tackle the changes yeah <laughs> ukweli and that's really good cuz unajua i feel like it's important u handle kitu yenye unaweza kitu iko within your power and then the rest in a workout too cuz yeah. unajua what you ingine singing na complain ati mafuta na na gari una so ni nini inakuwasha so una cuz it's global it's not even just in our country it's yeah, happening yeah, everywhere yeah. Mm-hmm. So we just have to adjust. Unasema eh hey, life inaenda hivi, mm-hmm. it's fine. Let me adjust maybe when unasema lifestyle kiasi. Mm-hmm. Kama uko unapiga sherehe every weekend, sema wacha ni eh. weekend mbili hizo zingine eh. ni, ni turn down. Mas. And that's how you move. So mm-hmm. something else pia may have to adjust pia ni ku kuwa responsible mm-hmm. na ku own maybe mistakes zangu mm-hmm. ama achievements. Okay. Mm. Eh okay. Na hiyo ni important that's very important you have to own your mistake I, yes. I call them lessons yeah. either una win ama una learn lesson like, like, like a term blaming is idea mm. but no. niki ku blame it doesn't bring anything good true we have to find like a, a way out of your problem mm. instead of complaining and blaming each other about it true, yeah true, true. Mm. Now i feel like you kuna mindset ya being solution oriented na problem oriented mm-hmm. yeah. focus on the solution, solution what can yeah. you do as opposed yeah. to hey shida iko ni sawa shida iko iko hapa mm-hmm. what next okay. so in in line with that what you ngile procrastination ju watu wanza wanasema hii mwaka naingia gym hii mwaka niko serious na fitness nitakimbia <laughs> nafanya hivi as you not down match nafika uko like <laughs> What are you on the next year? <laughs> <laughs> so, your your impact your procrastination. Ushai kuwa na hiyo difficulty Mara and you na procrastinate. Mara mob sana. Kwanza ndio unapataga nilikuja hiyo lakini nime nime work on that. Nimekuaga na hiyo pros- procrastination. Asante <laughs> sana. Ulimi nimeacha nyumbani. Sasa hiyo <laughs> pro procrastination. Asante sana. <laughs> Ilikuaga inani drainisha sana kwanza hata kuika career yangu napata najua nguo yako ni rahisi naweza ishona hata in in the in the next 5 minutes ama 10 minutes eh lakini kwa ile asni kadogo tu daisha na kesho in the next 2 hours na unajua ina kwanga issue kwa sababu tunaenda kwa fundi kwa ile umeona umeambia design drink kwa nataka eh tuesday sasa hii gadili na kwa hiyo si mbona mafundi mko si si nio pro hiyo 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 ndio ilikuwa inakuwa na problem unaweza pata mtavurugana na fundi juu a tiny mistake kushona complicated nguo ama kufanya a, new, a whole new project haina issue utaweza pata tunakosa nia juu ya kukosa ku iron ama kukosa kuweka buttons ama mahali fulani kama utaipata hata mnasumbua na kitu serious sana mm, so jeo kurusharusha yesu unasema ah before akuje ndakuwa nimeguza 
anaenda before akuje enda kwa ni eh which sasa inakuwa tricky ya times na hiyo kurusha rusha tu ndaifanya kesho ndaifanya baadaye hivyo so una feel ni kama solution ni kufanya size size or size hakuna hakuna time best time best ni size No una kwanga na hiyo issue like as I'm saying no collect na funny drop his song hey, but you collect like, hey week. watch and tena kwa studio next week hey. ama tu tunaanza monday hey. have you faced that that issue in your career of course pia yeah, mimi sometimes procrastination ime affect kazi yangu mm. like unapata nimeandika song nime schedule a like studio session lakini hiyo time ikifika una feel yeah. <laughs> can we do it tomorrow <laughs> 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 fresh eh <laughs> <laughs> uh, so ina inafanya pia unakuwa na kuwa slow kwa venye na move so pia mimi i had to look to that na ni shughulikia na uchange and i think personally what time ni confess nimekuwa na hiyo issue naweza kuwa na mbo you have to write a document ni kwa like ah si ni kona content ini 30 minutes ni remaliza siku zinapita ama unaanza uko like eh hey, wacha ni watch episode moja what? Netflix moja <laughs> season inaisha <laughs> so i think when you're nasema ni important mm. ufanye sayo sengine you don't have the motivation yeah. so hata una psych mm. but you have to push yourself useme mm-hmm. nimejicommit si ndio eh hey, wacha nifanye tu say mm. get out of the way mm. na nime find that mara nyingi vitu hazikwangi tricky mm. unaweza une patata ni ku clean room ya si i don't know si tu na complicate cuz we over Yeah. think things yeah. na sengine ni kitu straight forward ukifanya unapata tu umemaliza in a shorter time than you expect nah, mm, so hiyo ni kitu yenye hata nyinyi mkiwa home mm-hmm. really work on procrastination because i feel like that is one thing and you affect na goals zetu na resolutions because mm-hmm. we push things tunasema i'll start on monday i'll start next month i'll start next year start right now literally uki yeah. sa easy to like the time is now now yeah. is all we got now is all we got sema cheki unaweza sema kesho jana lakini hizo zote zina happen size so yeah. mm. zina unfold to from now eh yeah, yeah. so if now ndio inafanya future ina happen the yeah. nico if you don't do it now kesho you got promised that's true mm. so uh, to keep wind up the conversation Let's talk about next year cuz next year it's just like three weeks away sindio <laughs> so <laughs> what are we doing different personally kwa life ya new kruger what do you think you're going to do different next year ndio u achieve goals za kama goals gani zitakuwa umesema hii mwaka nimekuwa na hizi goals nime achieve so next year i'm doing something better so nimekuwa ni release singles uh, next year i'm planning to go big i'm dropping an album nice yes. that's hiyo tu hata ime summarize ndio hiyo ni project so Zima. i think that's my hiyo ndio ita cover the better part of my next of year, next year. Okay. Mm. Nice. and utatwambia later on atatwambia social media zake and then we'll find you tunaenda kusikiza lazima tu support Kuskia. local I artists you have you have to you, <laughs> you ought to <laughs> we ought to and we'll call you back to tell us how that went <laughs> so Eh uh, unaweza tuambia hata my producer is saying you can just tell us uh, your social media platforms penye tutakupata across all platforms tuambie music yako tunakupata wapi na where as an artist tunakupata wapi so you can google my name pia that's easiest kupata mm. from there utapata profiles zangu mm. but my name ni universal kwa easy platforms za streaming kama Spotify Deezer Boomplay YouTube ki google uki search tu jina kruga gush i believe mnaonyesha hapo chini so when they search immediately when they search search my name skiza niko na mziki fit sana huko yeah na very diverse like i feel like niko na something for everyone nice we like that because you ni important check me out ni follow kwa ig under the same name kruga gush tiktok kruga gush bas tutakupata hapo like, tunaenda tukutafuta tu size immediately <laughs> so samunje oh. tell us we mwenyewe pia what are you going to do differently next year and then we wrap up ukituambia tunakupata wapi tukuze kutafuta kama tunataka nguo yeah. na unatutengenezea mali safi <laughs> kabisa kabisa, yeah. kabisa, kabisa kabisa mimi kwa all social media platforms mtanipata uh, my personal name naitwa samonje mugoya lakini my brand name inaitwa samonje vazi in all social media platforms instagram tiktok facebook mtapata huko kazi tunaweka huko na mm. pia details za namba pia ziko huko pia eh, mm. eh, next year nafikiria ku nilikuwa nafikiria nilikuwa nataka kufungua ka, kama ka semi college ama tunaweza sema ka 
ka story ka fashion nimekuwa nikifundisha wase mm. wengi, eh, story ya uh, maneno na fashion how to make clothes from scratch ni kama ka mini college hivi eh ndio tunakuja eh, tutakuja kwa hiyo shule karibuni tukuze. sana karibuni sana mm, so thank you so much uh, time imetuishia leo unfortunately this conversation has been very beautiful because na feel ni kama ni learn so much from our guests na i hope ukiwa nyumbani pia ume learn something hii mwaka hata kama inaisha aimanishi imeenda hivyo you've grown in one way or another whether you set goals or resolutions ama if you didn't do anything so be sure to check in next year useme what you want to to accomplish january kianza usiseme tu mwaka itaenda hivyo tena set goals write them down figure out by the end of next year 2024 uki look back ukwena difference between size na next year at the same time so thank you so much i think that is it for today my name is Cheryl Blessing and you have been watching the Power Talk show. Thank you so much for sticking to Y254 TV. I really appreciate you for watching us and thank you to the entire team and my producer Timo uko jana ni arakisha na time. Asante ni sana ku watch. A repeat of this will happen tomorrow between 1 and 2 p.m. and you can go to our YouTube page ndo upate other videos. Uh, and that's it. So have a lovely evening. I'll see you next week. Ciao. <laughs>